Hi, welcome back to the Zankwack channel. Tonight I'm going to be going over a pressure point technique. We're going to use the median nerve. Okay, this is right in the center of his arm here, in the lower portion of the arm, right in the middle, not off to the side or off to the side. The median nerve is in here in the middle. Okay, we call this arm three in the American pressure point self-defense system. Step over here. Now when you're pressing, I notice a lot of people end up pressing with the flat part of the thumb. When you go in, you want to use the tip of your thumb, the very tip. The deeper sense nerves, you have to go down deep, but you won't get a reaction. So if I'm pressing up here or going flat, what do you feel here? You feel some, but not much. He's going to wail off and punch me in the face. Okay? So there's certain circumstances you can use this, but you've got to get good at it. This takes practice. I suggest getting a tennis ball. Hold the tennis ball and practice pressing your thumb, the tip of your thumb in and out until you strengthen these muscles in your arm here and in your hands to where you can just grip to the pressure points better. It takes a little practice. Okay? In our school we use no fake reactions. Everything we do is real. So if I'm pressing on a point here, okay, this actually happened. He's feeling the pain. Okay, I can control him like that. Stand up. Okay, hold it. Stand up, Jeff. Stand up. Okay, that's all from the point, you okay? Yep. Step up, okay. So, we also can use it in combination with this one over here, which increases the power. So, if you put your finger over this line here, and you go up a little more over towards the biceps muscle, we're going to do the same type of press straight in. But this time, you okay? Yep. Okay, this time I, I had grabbed this. So, say maybe he pushed me or something. Hey, hey would he crazy? I don't want any problems. I grabbed them both. Notice I stepped on his foot. Why? Because when I collapse him, I still have control over where he is now in case I want to finish him up. I don't want him coming over here or I want to control where he falls. I also don't want him falling into me. Okay, I want to control that. All right? Were you going with that or are you trying to fight it? I'm trying to fight it. Okay. So, look at the more practice you have, you might try it and it's not working for you yet. It takes practice. Okay? It's just like punching. The first time you threw a karate punch, were you an expert at it? How many years before you felt like you were real, real good at it? Take it easy, okay? If you go too deep and you get real good at it, I've a few times had people faint just from pressing it. And one thing I do when we do in the American Pressure Point Self-Defense System when teaching pressure points, okay? One thing we do is this. We never tell somebody, okay, if I hit this point, then hit this point, then do this point, this is what the reaction is going to be. Because you're putting that thought in their head. Okay? You're using the power of suggestion. And that's not really teaching you if the point works or not. I want to know. Grab me or something. Go ahead. I want to know if the point's actually going to collapse the person without telling them what I'm doing. That's what a pressure point should do, or it's a bunch of bull. You want to use a pressure point for real and learn how to, don't tell the person what's going to happen to them when you're doing it. Just do the point and see if it works right for you. Then you know it's not them going with what they wanted, you wanted them to do. They're collapsing out of sheer pain or dysfunction of their motors, of their motor skills because of the pressure point. All of a sudden, all their motor skills are gone, or this, their ability to hold their muscles still and their legs are gone, and they collapse. Thanks again. I'm going to be putting a lot more pressure points on, but if you really want to get heavy into the pressure points, I suggest you go to BushidoProductions.com um, and order some of our videos. We have a great amount of different uh, videos on pressure points. We have a 12-tape step-by-step clinic series that takes you up the ladder of pressure point knowledge. And believe me, you get up the ladder, I show some cool stuff up, up in the higher levels. We haven't had any complaints on our pressure point video, so definitely take a look at that. Look at our site, newideamas.com, and even take a look at um, my other sites. I have the uh, newideamartialarts.com, or newideamas.com, bushidoproductions.com, and you can take a look at my site, belmontmartialarts.com. That's my dojo site. Thanks again.